Okay, today I want to show you how easy it is to make a web page with just simple tools like Notepad++. Um, you can get a more fancy editor or a fancier editor whenever you like, but I use Visual Studio Code and but I just wanted to show people that are just starting out with coding. We don't need fancy tools to get started. So let's create our first web page. What we need is some tag, first of all, to let the browser know how to display the information that we're putting in this file. So hypertext, hypertext markup language is the language of the web. And that's what the browsers understand and display for us. So let's put, start with that. This is going to be where we put all our information between these two tags. Anything in here is HTML. So next thing we do, and I'm going to tab just in here and just put a head tag and then a closing head tag. Second row. And in our, in our head tag, we need a title tag. The head is the start of the web page. Um, and it lets the browsers know like what your site is about. There's meta tags in here for search engines. You'll see, I'll show you an example in just a second uh, of what that looks like. But let's put our title as my first web page. Uh, okay. Now we're going to have the body tag. This is where all of our information that the user sees in the browser is going to live. So between these tags, let's just put a, an H1, a heading tag. An H1 is the largest heading tag there is. And there's one allowed per page. Let's just call this my first web page also. Okay, so the title tag is what shows up in your tab. So for example, over here it says problem noting page. That's the title tag of that page. I was trying to go to localhost. And then this H1 will show up in this area. And this is your body section. Anything that the viewers, the user sees on the web page. So let's just save this and see what it looks like. If we go to our file, open in default viewer, it should open in over here. Okay, yeah. There's my first web page. And if we right click anywhere in there and view page source, we'll see what we put in. And we can also inspect and look at different things like uh, the inspector here. If we actually will have, you know, CSS properties and stuff eventually. But you can look at these things and you can actually change these. You can make it my second web page. Web page. Isn't that cool? All right. So that's it for today's lesson, I think. Um, oh, actually, I'm going to show you what I was talking about the meta tags. Let's just go to LinkedIn. And we'll right click and view source on this and see. View page source. And you'll see here's the head, the document type HTML, the head section starting here. There's the title. And the end of the head section is probably way down here somewhere. But here's all your meta tags, all your descriptions, the content everything else, the viewport. And we'll get to that later, but I think that's a good start for today.